What is poppin' pommies? My name is Senevis and welcome to Osaka. It's an ex action adventure game, but it's also a study experiment where I as the player am actually being experimented on by real people trying to look into how game choice affects the overall gamer experience. So I filled out a whole questionnaire, blah blah blah. You don't need to see that, it's boring tech stuff, but still, I'm really excited to see what's going on and let's join. So you are new to the city of Osaka, enamored, but mostly just nervous. You have always wanted to visit Japan, but you did not think you would feel so stranded. It could be simply because your hotel is too far from the, into, into the insides of the city. It could be because you have not traveled alone in a while. Or because your friend who was to show you around Japan, who told you not to start in Tokyo like every other land culture enthusiast, was who was going to show you the most fabulous izakeyas, changed her mind. Just like that. What a rest. Anyhow, she has kindly offered to come visit you in your tiny hotel room to give you travel tips. Sure. At least for the night you have a plan. She comes. It's surprisingly nice to see her, especially to hear her voice. You feel at home and start to feel confident about your trip. It is getting late. You want her to stay, but you don't say it. She abandoned you after all. You are about to say your goodbyes when you hear loud voices in languages you don't understand blast through the window. She's alarmed as you are. There are more penetrating voices now coming from the corridor as well. What? She looks confused. Why are they doing this? We should get out of here, she says in a hushed tone. You are scared and clueless. Why, why are they doing what? No reply. You can see she knows more about than you can see that she knows more than you, but wouldn't say. You look around. Well, we can't possibly get out of here. There's, there's a tiny window, and I'm guessing the front door isn't safe either. She says, "Who knows? Maybe it is. Maybe it's nothing." Crazy noises continue. We should split our chances, though. You stare blankly. Uh, I I don't understand. God, we need to hurry. She cuts you off. Pick one. Oh shit. Um. So we got the window, which is tiny, and we got the door, which is probably not safe. But it's probably a faster bet. So I'm guessing that I'm a chunky fellow and maybe I can't get through the window. So let's go through the front door. I mean, they're both not safe. So let's just do it. Front door. All right. Being a tourist. All right. Okay. <laughs> All right. Being a tourist, you should be able to walk through the corridor without really interacting. Just pretend you don't understand anything and wait. You don't need to pretend. She chuckles. <laughs> Actually, yeah. I will climb down the window. Run when you get downstairs and I will see you around the second block. It'll be okay. Try not to panic. Alright, let's go! How carefully did you consider the option you chose? Um, I would say... <laughs> I would say six. I would say around here. 60, 60. I would say... I would say 72. I'll, I'll round there, yeah. So how clear, how carefully did you consider the option you chose? I would say about like 68 sounds good. Yeah, I mean, I mean, honestly, I didn't think too much, but I still thought about it. How clearly could you tell the consequences of your choices would be? Um, 50. I really didn't really understand what was going on. How free did you feel to choose the, between the options in the game? I felt, I felt like there was something holding me back. I don't know why. How much impact did you feel your choice had on the outcome? Uh, I think it had a very high impact. I feel like there's going to be a big impact. <laughs> How likely are you to continue playing this game? Ah, uh, I'd say, yeah, I'd say 88. I'm interested. I'm, let's do it. Let's do it. Thank you for your participation. Wait. Uh, that was it? That was... Okay! Uh, I really thought that... You can't just... I want to know what happens! What are you talking about? That's it? Okay, well then, Palmings, that's it, I guess. It's an interesting study. I can't wait to see what the results are. I mean, I don't really care at this point because i want to see i just really care about the story i want to see what happens anyways i guess that's it for today and uh, i hope you all enjoyed because i i'm just really lost i'm, I'm really confused right now but <laughs> i hope you all enjoyed and this is Senvis, signing off